Centralia Coaches Corner, a service of Blue Valley Technologies, Wanklin Oil, and First Heritage Bank. Think big this school year. As your child gets ready for a new school year, think beyond shopping for a bigger backpack or a bigger pair of shoes. You may also need to upgrade to bigger speeds for your home's internet connection. Blue Valley Technologies offers A-plus internet plans. Existing customers bump your speed and get a $50 bill credit. New customers, you get two months free and everyone gets free installation on managed Wi-Fi. Visit bluevalley.net for more information today. Everyone has something that they do best. Banks are no exception. Ours is investing back into the local communities that we serve. We make loans to local families and businesses. These loans generate the dollars which empower our local community. Invest in our community by banking with us. We're an equal housing lender. First Heritage Bank in Centralia, Corning, Seneca, and Vermilion. Member FDIC, online at 1hbank.com. now, but somebody will get back to you eh, sometime. Yeah, th this is Frank Jones, and I'm switching propane companies. Why? Wanklin Oil has more to offer, and to be honest, better prices. They also gave me options to fit my budget, and in case you don't remember, I called last week because I was nearly out of propane. You never called me back. I'm now out of propane. Switching propane dealers is no big deal. Call Wanklin Oil at 1-800-794-2019. Wanklin Oil, we've had the energy since 1926. Welcome back into the show. I am now joined by head coach of the Centralia Panthers, Roger Holthouse. Coach, you went over to Valley Heights, got a 34-14 victory over there last Friday. How do you think the boys played? How do you think the game went? I thought, uh, Max, we did a, you know, from start to finish, I, I thought we, were, we weren't bad. Um, of course, we, we, we got stuff to work on yet. Yeah, I thought offensively, first half, we was very efficient. Uh, kind of sputtered there in the third quarter. I thought coming out halftime, um, defensively we gave up one drive. We just couldn't get off the field. Too many gave up too many third and longs and fourth downs, and uh, so those things we need, we definitely need to improve on. But overall, I, I thought the kids for their first game, new positions, new coaching staff, um, they they did a pretty good job. We talked last week how uh, like tackling was going to be a big emphasis, not only in game one but throughout the season. Two kind of big, decent runs, a fifty-yard run there. How do you? work on that, kind of clean that up this week in practice? Uh, yeah, it was a 50-yard run uh, uh, that was kind of late in the game, and we mm. had young kids out there. But, um, you know, they had another long run. I, some of that was just our fit. We didn't we didn't fit in quite right. A kid ducks inside, and running back popped out. So, um, you know, those those things are very correctable. We just got to continue to work on them to, to get our fits down so we don't give up those big chunks. Going over to the offensive side of the ball, you yourself had some pretty good success running the ball as well. How does that help you from a coach's standpoint calling the game? Well, I think it, it, it definitely it definitely helps to just throw the ball a little bit better. Than, you know, it's not that we didn't throw a bad, we had a couple of better receivers had a couple go through their hands and uh, that they normally catch. But um, I like, the passing game's got to get much, much better. Uh, I think we need to get just a little bit more consistent. You know, we can't have that third quarter lapse where we didn't really didn't move the ball at all and um, kind of stalled out there a few times. But uh, finish strong in the fourth quarter, though. Yeah, always good to especially finish strong, start off strong. Sometimes lulls happen, but that's just part yep. of the game. Coming up now, you face a Christian Prep Academy with a pretty balanced offense and an athlete in the backfield change of pace sort of game. How do you um, attack this week from a, I guess, film study standpoint? Well, I, I think Max said, uh, it's, it's, you know, it's, it's different last week. Last week they were double tight and um, kind of, you know, kind of run right, try to run you over, run at you. Mm -hmm. This week it's, you know, they got you spread out from sideline to sideline. They're going to try to get to the corner and try to get some big plays. We, we definitely got to, you know, again, it comes back to those fits. We get, definitely got to have our fits because one kid misses a assignment or it's fit, and it, it's, it's going to be a long, it's going to be a big chunk chunk play. So, um, but it's, we need this game and see where we kind of stand with the, we think kind of double tight. Now we need to see kind of the um, other side of the spread stuff. So I'm looking forward to it. You kind of talked about they're getting boys in the right position. Are they are they catching on fairly good, learning each week? Yeah, I, I, yeah, I think like, you know, we watched film yesterday and, 
and, I, and you can hear him. So, that, you know, like, you know, I see now, I see that where I made that mistake. And sometimes you just got to go through it and, 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 you know, learn from your mistakes. And, and next time, hopefully you don't make that same mistake. But, um, you know, they, they're, they're big. They got big kids up front, yeah. around 230, 40 across the line. And, uh, and they're, they're a heck of a lot faster than we are because we're, we're plow horses and they're like thoroughbreds. So we got to do, we got to do a very good job of getting people to the football, seven, eight guys to the football. Probably important to running running the ball, controlling the clock this game as yeah, well. Yes, and, and yeah, we got to run the ball, and of course that's what we need to do every week. But yeah, um, yeah, we need to run it and, and try to establish the run game and shorten the game down a little. Well, sounds like a tough test coming up this week, Coach. I appreciate you. Best of luck coming up. All right, I appreciate it, Max. Centralia Coaches Corner, a service of Blue Valley Technologies, Wanklin Oil, and First Heritage Bank.